Hello, uh, welcome to 272 East Road in Bayport. Uh, this is a four bed, two bath cape uh, with a rear dormer in South Bayport. It's a, a fantastic value. And um, my name is Bryn Elliott with Douglas Solomon Real Estate. And there at the property is my associate, uh, Richard Gaudet. So Rich is there to be our camera person for the tour. And um, let me put the camera on Rich so we can see the front of the house there. And uh, There we go. So uh, we're looking at the front of the home. Again, this is 272 East Road in Bayport or in South Bayport. You have a, it's a Cape, uh, you have a two car detached garage, which is a real nice, uh, real nice plus there. As you can see, there's vinyl siding and it's a, it's a four bed, two bath home with a rear dormer. So it's about 1200 square feet altogether. And uh, as you enter, you walk into the living room and you have um, the staircase to your right and you have hardwood floors. Okay, like I said, the home is about 1200 square feet, uh, almost on the head actually. And it was built in 1953. So then as we, you know, there's a linen closet right ahead and then to the left is the kitchen. It's an eat-in kitchen. And uh, they don't make them like they used to. Those cabinets uh, were, I'm almost certain, built in place. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty much positive on that. And um, so if you wanted, you could um, paint them. A lot of people uh, keep those quality uh, solid cabinets and, and paint them and update the kitchen or you know whatever you want to do with it. So it's a good space. Uh, Good cabinet space, nice uh, eating kitchen there. Uh, then to our left, we have a full bath. Uh, There's a you know three-piece bathroom with a, a bathtub, your toilet, and you have a pedestal sink. You know, you know, plenty of room for a regular vanity if you wanted to switch that up, ceramic floor. And then we'll head into uh, bedroom number one. Uh, this would be the master bedroom. There's good closet space in here. Again, the hardwood floors continue through this uh, through this bedroom. Okay. Yeah. Then we have uh, bedroom number two. The taxes on this home after uh, your basic star rebate come to $9,393.99. So that's $93.93 and 99 cents. And the true, and we could head upstairs now. You can see the hardwood floors there. Yep. Uh, the true tax are ten thousand six hundred and fifty-two dollars and twenty-four cents. There's your coat closet right at the base of the staircase by the front door. And you have oak stair treads. Heading upstairs, uh, like I said, there's a rear dormer. So uh, we could look at the bathroom first, I guess. You have a three-piece bathroom. This has a, a shower, a toilet, and vanity. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And then to the left, we have a, a real nice size bedroom. So with the rear dormer, it makes, uh, it makes for big bedrooms upstairs. And what a lot of people do with these capes, this home's, it's a great value. It's South Bayport. Uh, it's around the corner from the high school. And it's also around the corner from uh, right around the corner from Academy street elementary school. Uh, but it, it's a great home to get, get into South Bayport. Again, uh, very affordable between the price and the taxes. And um, it's a four bed, two bath, full basement, two car detached garage. And a lot of people take these capes and this one already has a rear dormer, as you can see uh, to the, that's not the dormant side and we'll scan the bedroom. No, no, that bedroom, Rich, that bedroom. Uh, so, so that's the front of the house that's not dormant. And as we pan the bedroom, to the left so that back is dormered so the back used to have that you know sloping roof line like the front but it was dormered maybe the maybe this was built with the dormer i kind of suspect that the builder built a cape and then it was probably dormered after the fact so i don't believe that rear dormer is original to the house but of course that's been done before all right so big bedroom so we could head down to the basement um so anyway a lot of people take these capes and they do a double dormer. So this one has a rear dormer. You could also dormer out the front, you know, when you get a, get to it. And then they'll make one side maybe a master suite with a master bath because you have the space. 
and then they'll make the other side two bedrooms. So you have like three beds up, maybe three beds in one bath or three beds in two baths. And then you have three or so bedrooms up. And, uh, and then they take some of the bedrooms on the first floor and turn them into other spaces like a dining room or a family room. So down in the basement, uh, they have this space that they use as, you know, sort of an office playroom and there's some storage shelves on the left. There's your electrical service. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, it's a, it's a big basement. So we, we're going to see uh, like kind of three spaces, that space right there to the right, that's where the oil tank was. So I'll talk about that as Rich shows you the basement. Uh, they just did a new oil tank uh, and they, it's outside and it's above ground. So the old oil tank was in the basement and the new oil tank is above ground. And, and by doing that, you have even more space in the basement now. And you can see all the storage down here. You have your laundry. Uh, you have a separate hot water heater. So it's an oil fired hot water heater and an oil fired burner. It's oil hot water heat. Okay, great. Thanks, Rich. Um, and now we'll, um, we'll head up and uh, we'll show you, uh, show you the yard. Um, somebody just, uh, just joined. So I'm just sending them a quick note. Um, what else can I tell you? Uh, so again, the house is about 1200 square feet and the detached garage records show that it's about 462 square feet. So it's a really, you know, nice size two car garage. And uh, here's the uh, here's the backyard. It's almost fully fenced. If you just did a return of the fencing on either side of the house, you'd have a fully fenced in backyard. So there you have it. Four bed, two bath home, full basement, two car detached garage, hardwood floors, great taxes, South Bayport, uh, terrific value, great price. Uh, so um, if uh, if you have any questions uh, and you're working with an agent, uh, please reach out to your agent. Uh, your agent can schedule an appointment to get you in to see the property. Uh, so if you're working with an agent, please communicate through your agent. If you're not working with an agent, uh, please feel free to give myself a call or my, my teammates a call. We are here to help. We'd love to answer all your questions, get you in to see the house. Uh, my name is Bryn Elliott at Douglas Elliman Real Estate. And uh, there at the property is, uh, is Rich Gaudet uh, to give us this tour. So thanks, guys. Have a great day.